What's up everybody, Tidamic Games here and welcome back to Let's Play uh, Legend of Zelda The Minish Cap. Now on the last part, I had gotten through some Caster Wilds and now we're over here in um... Uh, what is this place called? I don't even remember where I am. I took a bit of a break. Oh, we're in the Wind Ruins, okay. So... Okay, so recently I got a little bit of popularity on Reddit one of my comments got a little bit popular and people asked me to link to my channel so if any of you are here from there welcome and I appreciate you for sticking with me and watching this um, and second of all um, I appreciate all the feedback and every comment and everything that you guys have been giving me and uh, I've been making strides I'm currently making strides actually to uh, better my voice right now I've got myself some herbal tea and uh, it may seem like I'm really calm and chill right now, but honestly on the inside I'm like freaking out because this is super awesome. Like that anybody even cares enough about my videos to watch them. Anyway, I'm done ranting. It's time to talk about the game. So in the last episode I told you I was going to go bomb this and open this and see what's inside. Because I wonder. Ooh, what's in the chest? A blue kinson piece. Awesome. That'll be good for... Uh, later when I need it. Um... Okay, so... Oh god, okay, well that guy woke up. I did not expect that to happen. I thought I was gonna have to wake him up. Oh jeez. The armor statues are a lot more uh, active in this game. Also, those guys are armor statues, if you weren't 100% sure on what those guys were. Yeah, you're stupid tech tights. But yeah, so, uh... Oh, this guy looks like he's not very active. He's not interested in me. But, if I go over here and turn tiny, I can actually walk up this little staircase on his shield and go inside of him and turn on his uh, little thingy majigger. And now he's uh, turned on and... Wait a second. There's a hole over here. Let's go check out what's in here. What's up, little pickery bro? These soldier statues here were built by the Minish ages ago to help humans. It's kind of a secret, but there's a switch inside that turns them on or off. I mean, I kind of figured that out by myself, but thanks anyway. Oh, dude, a red kinstone piece. Those are the most rare, so it's always nice to get some of them. Um, alright. So now... Oh, wait, he turned back off. Dang it. Ah, oh, I'm dumb. Alright. So now let's... Go ahead and turn him on. There's no sexual connotations. Don't even think about it that way. Alright, anyway. Come alive! And now I just attack him. These guys are actually much easier in this game, though, than they are in most of the other games. Ooh, he dropped a green Kinzo piece. That's pretty nice. Um. Alright, let's cut through. Oh, dude, I got another green Kinzo piece. God, I'm getting, like, so many Kinzo pieces right now. Now I can just walk over here at any time I want to. We're all good. Um, alright, so in here... Yeah, get out of here. Um, I guess this is just an extra room. I don't know. So what about the next room? Anything cool in here? Some bad guys I gotta fight. I'm also getting... Pretty wrecked. Not too bad. I'm doing pretty well for all things considered. I mean, hey, I've already beaten two dungeons in this game that only has four dungeons. So that's not too bad. Um, yeah. I don't know. There's not much to say really about the ruins or these wind ruins. I mean, they're really cool. I don't know. You know what they kind of remind me of? They kind of remind me of, um... For some reason, I get this weird, like, Serious Sam vibe from them. I don't know if any of you guys have ever played Serious Sam, but, um... I actually, like... Surprisingly, I actually really like that game, even though I'm not usually one for high-octane... Well, excuse me, high-octane, like, fast-paced gameplay. I actually really like that game, probably because of, um... Because of 
That's what I'm looking for. Nostalgia, maybe? I played them a lot when I was a kid, and so... The nostalgia's still there. Um... Man, to be honest, I'm actually struggling to not clear my throat right now. The tea has definitely helped me out quite a lot. Significantly, I can tell. But... I guess I'll always have problems with clearing my throat. It may just be a side effect. From living with, uh, smokers. Um... Let me see... Because I know, um... There's another uh, YouTuber that I watch a whole lot. His name is Nintendo Capri Sun. And I know that he's had problems all very often uh, because he's actually he actually is a smoker where he has problems clearing his throat and coughing in the middle of videos. So like I wonder if just me being around smoke so much has uh, affected me at all. That secondhand smoke. I mean, it must have. Secondhand smoke's really bad for you, I mean... You're literally getting the unfiltered smoke into your breath when you're breathing in secondhand smoke. Oh god, hi. You just sped way down there real quick, didn't you? Ah, oh, cool. Huh, oh, interesting. So if I get too close to this guy, he's gonna just speed down here and not gonna let me through. Hmm. There's something I gotta do, but first, let's go open up these chests here. Oh, dude, 50 rupees, nice. And 50 mysterious shells, dude. That is pretty freaking nice. Let's see, if I, if I go turn small here, is he gonna go back to where he was? Alright, he totally is. So I bet if I go inside and turn him off, he's not gonna bum rush the area and block me off anymore. Yeah, see? I'm a smart boy. I'm super smart. Even though I'm totally not that smart. In any case, I'm trying to remember. I think I, I think I get one of my favorite items in the game here. I don't know why, I just always have liked this item. And I'm not going to spoil it for you guys. My god, I'm just getting kinstone pieces left and freaking right. I guess that white pickle light was a good uh, investment after all. Hmm. You know what would be funny? It would be super funny if I like accidentally 100% of this game. Like, cause I never really intended to 100% this game, but if I just like ended up getting all of the kinstone fusions and everything. I don't know, that'd be kind of weird. Alright. I probably don't even need to grind anymore cause I don't really need any more kinstones or even rupees. I'm doing really fine on rupees. In the world. Oh, okay. We'll open that up. You know, Serious Sam is definitely one of those games that I want to play one of these days um, on my channel. But the problem that I have with playing it on my channel is that it's kind of like a tough game. It's not. And it's also very fast paced, and it would probably not be very good for um, my commentary, all things considered. Because I could, you know, talk about the game all day, but if I'm, like, in the middle of a fight, I won't be able to talk about it that much. In any case, let's go enter the Wind Ruins, the Fortress of Winds. Oh, is this the music that I really like? Hey, well, I mean, we're in the first dungeon, so I guess we might as well delve into here. I remember this dungeon, too. I remember the first time I played this dungeon. Because it's such a maze, it's so, so easy to get stuck in here, and I'd always get stuck. Oh god, not a bubble. Hey, that was a piece of heart, though. That'd be really, really useful for me. Hmm, to think the runes were hidden in, within this cliff this whole time. Watch your step, Tidy. There may be traps hidden here. Hmm, maybe. Yes, let's just keep going. Let's go figure out what I'm doing here. Because I've got no idea. Oh my god, there's a spooky Stalfos. Ah, dang it. Stupid bubble coming in shocking me. God dang it. I didn't want to get shocked. Oh well. Pull it, pull it, pull it! Get away from the bubble. Oh, dude, a kinstone piece. Those are always nice to get. Let's carefully follow this guy. Not Let's not fall down the hole because that would be bad. Very bad. 
Oh, awesome, they opened the door. And I got a kinstone piece. Another blue kinstone piece. They're always nice to get. So where does this go? Hey there. That's right, you ain't shit. Anyway. Um. Aw, oh, dude, there's a... What are those called? Mini Moldorms? Sorta. I like baby Moldorms. Honestly, I hate Moldorms. They suck. There we go. I took care of him pretty quick. And that's just a bubble. There's nothing important there. Um. Oh shoot, I can't... I can't press both of these at the same time. Oh, but... Oh god. Skulls just came running at me. Fight me, bro. Ah, he was stepping on one. I was like, these... Because I was looking at these and I was like, they're a little bit close together. I don't think I'd be able to press those buttons with those ones. Um... Okay, well, there's nothing I can do here. Except for this. Hmm. So now... If I'm careful... I can run over here and press the buttons. Nice! Right, let's go see what's inside here. Oh, this is just a thing to make me tiny. Cool. It's always nice. Oh, and so now I can go turn on this guy. Oh. I bet if... Oh, hmm. Should I just fall through the floor? Because I bet if I fall through the floor, as I'm small, I can go through that little hole in there and then get the uh, piece of heart that's there. Oh. Hmm. Interesting. I'm doing it. Screw it. These games are about adventuring, and I'm all for adventuring. Let's do it. Yeah, man, that's awesome. Now I got myself uh, another piece of heart. And it's always nice to get as many pieces of heart as you possibly can. Because... They're all over the place and they're just... No, no, they're just nice to get. So now I've collected three. And presumably there should be another... Uh, whoa. Hello, are you okay? Oh. Okay. For some, for some reason something took my... Uh, the... Uh, I don't know if it was still working just fine on your guys' end. I don't know if the capture is still fine. Here, just in case, let me sync it real quick. One, two, one, two, three. Okay. Hopefully, we're all good here. And I won't have to resync it with the capture and everything. Wait, what do I do now? Oh god, how do I grow bigger? Oh, I gotta just make my way back up after growing big in here. And I'm gonna have to free this little guy. And while I'm transforming here, let me go take a quick drink. Sorry, I was getting a little bit of dehydrated and I didn't want to, uh have to clear my throat because I know it bugs some people gotten quite a few uh, comments and whatnot about that and honestly I agree with you guys I totally should be better with uh, clearing my throat come on which one of these am I supposed to push ah damn it I didn't want to get shocked there we go found it anyway now I just gotta I guess make my way all the way back up there Oh well, it's not too much of a trek. It ain't too bad. So then, let's go... There, I guess? I don't know. Either way, we have we have good times here. Um... Alright. Oh god, excuse me. I could have to burp. Excuse me. Oh god. I'm sorry if you could hear that. Very burpy. I, I just get burpy often, especially when I'm eating or drinking something. Especially tea. Tea, tea makes me really gassy for some reason. And like, I don't know. Maybe it's because I kind of slurp it a little bit. Who knows? Let's move this guy out of the way of this little thingamajigger here. We don't need him there. Alright. We're good there now. So now let's pull this and see what it does because I don't know what it does. Hey, I need that. I gotta jump down and get that key then. Hmm, did something just fall down or was it my imagination? It was probably your imagination as well. Wow, that tea thing is actually really helped. I haven't cleared my throat, I don't think, once this video. I think I've had to like, maybe like, move my throat a little bit to kind of get some phlegm going. 
But I haven't had to clear my throat at all, so uh, I really appreciate the hints you guys and the tips that you guys have given me. It's very, very nice. Um, where does this go? This looks important. Hmm. Go break this, why not? I probably should have left that to keep the heart. No, well. Oh god, Skellymans! Get out of here. Oh god, stop. You're trying to jump on me. Quit jumping away from me. Silly Stealthos. Oh god. Okay, we're all good here. Hey man, come on, stop. There we go. It's easy as pie. Oh, and we still got these, uh... What are those guys called? Why am I forgetting? Are those guys Armos? No, because the Armos statues have been fighting. Those are probably Igors, aren't they? Hmm. I don't know, I think Igor is more of a Majora's Mask thing, isn't it? There we go. That wasn't too hard. Hmm. And escape! Oh god! Step! Step! Okay, we're doing good. We're fine. Let's go up this staircase and see what's inside this chest here. Oh, I got the dungeon map. That's pretty useful. I can check out uh, this dungeon and see where I have been and where I have not been. And also check out which uh, door I should open up here. But you know what, before I do that, I might be able to even get a second key. So I kind of want to check that out and see if there's a way to get a second- Oh, wait, what? What is this? Oh, interesting. Hmm, there's a puzzle here that I have not yet solved and cannot solve yet. No, oh, well, nothing I can do here. Man, all this stuff's trapped in, like, this weird clay sort of sand or something. I wonder if I'll eventually get some tool to dig them out or something like that. Maybe. Alright, let's see. Oh, these guys were just hearts. Should have saved them. I'm dumb. Oh well. Ah, stop! Stop bouncing on me. It's not cool. I mean, I don't know. It's just, it's just not something people do. You know, you just don't jump on people. It's just, it's weird and not cool. Okay, stop. What's with this? Can I shoot it? Ah! The old Zelda rule. If it has an eye, shoot it right in the eye with an arrow. I was about to say, this seems like a ambush room. Man, Zelda loves- or Zelda games love doing that to you. They love just trapping you into a room with a bunch of enemies and then making you fight. Well, it's a good way to test your combat a little bit. So, uh, who knows? Uh, I'm not trusting you, not even for a second. Hmm. I knew it! It's a like-like! I hate like-likes. I don't think anyone like-likes like-likes. Okay, that was really confusing. This one's definitely gonna be a like-like. Yeah, that was way too obvious. Come on, Nintendo, you can create japes better than that. Hey, come on, man. Just let me kill you, bro. What's so wrong with letting me hit you? I don't know. Anyway. Uh... Well, how long have I been going for? Almost 20 minutes already. Jeez. Hmm. Oh, I have a feeling I know how to do this area here. <laughs> okay. Okay. Just barely. Once I get through this area, I will, uh... Let me check my map real quick. Where am I? So I should go north, because there's a dead end to the north. Ah, damn it. Dead ends are always the places you want to go, because... Well, it's a dead end. I don't know. I feel like it's kind of obvious. There we go. So now I got that one. Oh, wait, do I really got to be that fast? Damn, this is probably going to take a few tries. Dang it! Okay, let's try this again. Got it. Ah, oh, come on, dude. Okay, well, we're here. In any case... Whoa, why are these guys... 
This guy's eyes are closed. Hmm. I'm trying to bet. As soon as I step on these buttons, I'm gonna wake up. It doesn't take a genius to figure this one out. <laughs> but. Yep, called it. Oh god. I can't. Can't use my. It wasn't letting me use my. Uh, I guess I can't use my bow when I'm in that form. Oops. Oh god. Whoops. Oh god. I'm totally not hitting these at the right time. God, I keep hitting them at the wrong time. There we go. Oh god. That didn't work as I <laughs> thought it would. It takes a second for you to get back prepared and do another uh, attack. In any case, I bet this is either the compass or the item. Let's check it out. I got the compass. Yeah, I figured it was the compass. Not a big deal, but it lets me know where uh, all the chests and stuff are. Although one thing that the compass doesn't do that I think it should do is it doesn't it doesn't tell you where pieces of hearts are. And I think it totally should. Well, we're at about 20 minutes, so I'm going to have to cut it here. It's a pretty good place to cut it. I've got the compass. Now, um, I'll be checking out the rest of the dungeon and I'll probably beat it in the next episode. So, uh, if you enjoyed this video, check out my channel for a lot more videos. L excuse me. Check out my channel for a lot more videos just like it. And, uh, I don't know. I guess I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.